One boy killed, another hurt after they were hit while crossing a street on a bike in Lawrence this weekend. WRTV Stephanie Wade is speaking with people about the need for increased pedestrian safety as police urge drivers to be more vigilant. The two brothers were trying to cross Post Road here near the Jamestown apartments when a driver hit them, killing 11-year-old Isai Raimundo and his 15-year-old brother still in the hospital tonight. What a terrible tragedy for this family to have to endure. To hear something like that about two young people, one tragically lost their lives, the other was in critical condition. It was around 8.30 Saturday night when the two boys riding on the same bike together were crossing the street and were hit by a southbound driver. Lawrence PD says there were no obvious indications that the driver was impaired. The 11 year old died at the scene. It's a busy, busy road, North Post Road, it's a major thoroughfare. And uh, there are two apartment complexes here that are across from each other. And, uh, you know, there are, there are sidewalks, uh, there are street lights here. Indianapolis City County Councilors Lakeisha Jackson and Keith Graves issued a statement sharing their condolences with the family and saying in part, quote, unfortunately, last night's accident was one of several in recent weeks involving cars and pedestrians or cyclists. We implore motorists in our districts and across the city to slow down and to be extra careful to look out for your neighbors on foot or bicycles. This is just something that we have to do better with, with respects to looking out for one another and looking out for those that are crossing the street. They're kids. They're going to do what kids do. So at the end of the day, we just want to come together and rise above all this and really just continue to be that resilient community that I know we can be. Howard Harding leads the Reset Center directly next to where the crash occurred. While there are street lights in this exact area, Lawrence PD noting they were on and working properly that night. Some community members feel there could be more throughout the community to enhance pedestrian safety. There needs to be more street lights. There needs to be something that will allow greater visibility of people walking. I mean, this is a very busy street and you see a lot of people crossing in the middle of the street. They don't wait till they get to the corner. Some of them cross right in the middle of the street. And I think if there were better street lights, uh, that would make a difference in them, the, the drivers being able to see the pedestrians. Stephanie Wade, WRTV. And we will keep you updated on this case or if any charges are filed.